Hello bootleg bay tubers and welcome back to Let's Play Might Magic 6 The Mandate of Heaven with me Blue Ankylo. In our last episode we uh, managed to get Pyro promoted to priest which is great for uh, his uh, hit points and spell points and we uh, came to bootleg bay to uh, start doing a couple easy quests to get them out of the way early on rather than later before they're super super easy. So we cleared the temple of Sansa which was way up here and I had to look it up, but the quest reward, or we're supposed to bring this girl, um, Cheryl, back to Freehaven. So we'll have to go back there later. For now, I want to do one more quest while we're in Bootleg Bay. There are two more. There's one at this temple, which is kind of a little bit harder. And there's one at this kind of Fire Lord pit. I can't remember. I think I showed you the door when we were down there. And that one's pretty dangerous too. I remember those two dungeons being a little bit harder. But this one shouldn't be too bad. So let's head on over and see what happens. It's also, I think, pretty small. Then we'll have to figure out something else to do for today's episode. <laughs> so, of course, welcome back, folks. We're primarily trying to get money right now because uh, we've got a lot of skills that need training up and spells to buy and stuff and not a lot of money. This large but simple structure has become the center of worship for a small religious group called the Order of the Fist. All right, let's do this thing. Oh, it's one of these dark of ones. Place. Good. This is why we've got torchlight. So you'll be able to see this much better than usual. And we'll go with wizard's eye. And let's begin. What is in here? I don't remember this place terribly well, but I thought it wasn't too bad. As I was thinking of places to go. Skull pile of curses. Well, that's friendly. Oh, good. Rats. <laughs> is that all? Alright, alright. Again, this is probably why I thought this was a good place to go. Um, so what is the status ailment we have here? This is diseased. Yay. So we can cure that. No big deal. I guess coming here super early before you have cure disease might have been difficult. But they are just rats. So, you know, they shouldn't be too bad. Now there are more than rats here. Don't uh, don't forget. Oh, what did I just open up? I'm not even sure what I'm opening up. Opening up that has all this stuff in it. Anyway, we'll take this stuff for now. Was it the bucket? Oh, it was this sack. I thought it was just a gold sack. No, no. And we also have some uh, some barrels. Is there anything in any of these? Apparently not. It's a very awkward place. All right, let's continue on. See what's over here. More rats. All right. Is that it? Well, that was pathetic. Rats. Lame. Very lame. So more barrels with nothing in them, but a. Uh... You pull the torch. Well, we followed the arrow. We pulled the torch. We click the switch. All right, I think I solved that. That was pretty easy. Skull pile of curses. What do you think's in there? Something that mm, may be good but cursed us? <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I should probably have someone else pick through it to try to find stuff because if you're cursed, you have a failure chance on your spells. So, um, there we go. We got a scroll. What do we get? Aha. Guardian angel scroll. Woohoo! Ring of accuracy. Well, I'll give it to somebody. Let's give it to uh, let's give it to War Raider for now. He's got the good bow, but a plus one accuracy is not very good buff. So we'll probably end up selling that off before too long. But I might as well fill up your rings at some point, so you've got items. All right. Something in here. Oh, monks again. Yay, monks. It's been a while since we've seen monks. Did you miss them? Monks aren't too bad, right? Especially novice monks. They're nothing at all. Come on, guys. Just kill the novice monk. They seem to have a pretty good armor class. Hard to hit, but uh, no, no. Got it. 
There you go. I thought there'd be something in this. Aha. Cure disease. We'll take. Aha. I guess we'll take the shields as well. We do need every penny we can get right now. So, uh, oh, there we go. So now we're getting a larger group. Just trying to find a good spot to hit these guys from. Maybe I should pause it. Kind of hit this guy through the wall, so. Can't hit anybody there. Let's just move back a little bit. Try from here. This should be good. Come on. Yeah. Ah, oh, don't mind that little firebolt. You'll be fine. Well, that guy dodged away pretty quick. Hitting him through the wall. Good deal. Good job, Pyro. And good job, Pyro, again. Yeah. Got it. All right. What do we get? A letter from the Temple of Ba. Let's check it out. Hmm. It appears that the crystal you have uncovered is not quite what we had anticipated, but we do acknowledge its use. We will decide to send a few clerics to examine. Well, we will send a few clerics to examine the crystal and then decide what to do. Prepare for them in a few weeks. All right. So this was that place we're supposed to destroy that crystal, right? Crystal Xantrax. Oh boy, here we go. So this time, Master Monks. Not so easy. <laughs> We've got spell points this time, though. As long as we can survive. Alright, next. Oops, I didn't need to use the archer. I meant to shoot fireballs. Yeah, not bad. We got him halfway dead already. More fireballs, I think. Thank you very much, Dawes. Are you going to come back? Scared him away just like that, little chicken monks. So much. Now, don't... Don't underestimate these guys. I'm pretty sure they're they're fairly strong. We've just been a little bit lucky. See, look at how much damage that thing did. Heal up a little bit. All right. Good job. Good job. And that's, I believe, all we had to do here. So another very small little dungeon. I thought I should get this out of the way before too much time passes. I think that's all there is to it, really. I mean, I may miss... Oh, why did I do that? Walking through there seemed to be a bad idea. Minus 10 might temporarily. Yeah. Not sure what this button did, but... Uh, that switch opened this panel, and that button... I don't know. <laughs> Must have done something. I don't, I don't recognize it, though. Anyway, let's get out of here. We've got a couple of quests to turn in now. So if I remember correctly, last episode, there was a guy I was talking to about this quest with the crystal. Just in here, right? Greetings. No. This other side? How are you? There we go. Good work. I'm glad you made it in time. I don't like to think about what Bob would have done with that crystal. You have done all of Enroth a great service. And more reputation. There we go. That's the stuff we need. Also, now that we've got a bit of money, let's do some training. Back for another lesson? Or we can't do it from here. Never mind. Bootleg Bay must have a fairly low max level. Would you like to buy something? I would like to sell something, actually. Come again. They're always happier you with you when you actually happens. sell stuff. <laughs> Thanks. Anything else to sell? I don't know. Could get that identified. Mm. Just a normal ring. What you see is all I have. Da, 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 da. Come again. Over 11,000. We you still don't doing? have nearly enough money. Like, not even close. I could do some more uh, item buy and enchanting. Let's buy that one because it has to be unenchanted or else this won't work anyway. It has to be more than 450 as well. Should I do a little bit of that to make some money? What do you guys say? Anything that's valuable enough. Come back soon. So, uh, Dawes, how do you feel about enchanting uh, some armor? Does it sound like a good idea? Makes a little bit of money for us? 
Looks like you were successful. Not bad. Plus 10 to all resistances. I've seen worse enchantments, indeed. Enchant the helmet. And... Plus 12 endurance. Actually, not a bad helmet. Um, better than that one. You know, let's trade her up. Plus 7 endurance. We could trade that to somebody, too. And we'll keep the spell points. You know, I will take it. So now everybody's got How better health. How you doing? Come um, back. I forgot to give it to uh, our merchant, of course. How you doing? How you doing? All right. Come so we might not have made soon. much money there because I actually kept one, but. Uh, <laughs> All right. So also I should uh, I should rest up. Room around okay. the back. And I'm pretty sure we can turn a quest in in Freehaven, so let's do that. All righty. Also, I Don't guess. Don't touch the merchandise. You know, what do you guys think? Should I keep trying to make money? Well, they're already enchanted. Not that, though. Let's buy that. Oh, I'm not enchanted. Not enchanted. And none of this is going to be worth enough. Except that. Come back. So you got a few gauntlets to enchant. <laughs> uh, ah, shoot. I'm starting to fail now. Double fail. Come on, Dawes. Come on, Dawes. There we go, got one. Maybe I'll do some of this off camera next time. <laughs> what was that enchantment anyway? Cold resistance. Eh, not that great. It's fixed. It's fixed. Failed again. Oh come on, you only have a, a 60% chance to fail. That was a lot of fails, bread buddy. It's fixed. Alright, let's try this again. There we go, there we go. We're just trying to make a couple bucks, that's all. So that was a speed, That those are actually pretty good. Maybe I should keep some of these. <laughs> okay, come on, enough failing. You know what, I'll, as soon as I get you a level up, I, as soon as I can train you up, we'll, uh, I'll give you some magic. You know, maybe I should just do that first. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him some points into water magic. How about some, okay, okay. Also, we're getting 7 okay. per level up now, if you haven't noticed. So, uh, that's going to help. Yeah. So, Dawes. Skill points. I, I couldn't remember just when it switches to more than 5, but there you go. Let's go for um, significant water improvement. Plus 2. That, that's better than nothing, right? And Pyro, you can get... Identify up to 8. I think you need 7. It's always 7 or 8 to get masters. Let's go with eight and then we should be safe. And then you can work on your body magic. That splits them up nicely. Commander, merchant for sure for now. We gotta get that money up because we're so poor I find. I just don't have the cash. Um, and I'll save it for more. And then war raider, uh, probably seven or eight will be uh, master repair items. So once we get that going, then you'll be our repairer rather than Dawsocles. So that's the plan. That's the plan. So um, now that you've got a couple more points in water, uh, can you enchant a little bit better? Actually, first, let me see. Speed. Who would like speed gauntlets? They're actually not bad. Personality. Well, personality is okay. Endurance. Might you know what? We'll just sell it. Why not? No big deal. No big deal. Oh come on! I just gave you those points. <laughs> Don't be like that, Dawes. Two in a row. Come on. <laughs> it's fixed. Uh, it's just the randomness. I know. I know. There we go. Two in a row that time. Good deal. Good deal. So uh, speed again and poison. You like speed ga enchantments, don't you? All right. Uh, there we go. Oh, this is the wrong one. Sorry, this is the store. Uh, the weapon shop. Where's the armor shop? Did I just totally lose track of where I was? I probably did. I went to get trained and then I lost track of the armor shop. <laughs> there it is. Don't touch Good the job, Blue. Good job. So, if you were paying attention, you know, I, I paid so much for them and now I'm going to sell them back. I should have made a tidy profit. Um, I don't know how much exactly right now, but... Uh, Oh, that's a good one. We could enchant that helmet. Okay, let's pay attention. 
Um, apparently, the commander is such a good merchant that this guy will actually give it to us for its exact value, which is as good as it's going to get. Um, so he's getting the best price possible. So that's pretty cool. So we're going to buy $1,000 for this plate mail and 660 for that uh, helmet. Now, I do seem to recall that Merchant, it's fairly easy to buy stuff for its value, but selling it for its value is much harder. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, let's enchant. This will be the last enchanting for now, I promise. I just wanted to see if we could make a little bit of money. There we go, two in a row. That's a nice helmet. So anyway, let's see how much money we make. Don't touch the I should keep some of these eventually, but... Um, so this is making us 600 bucks by selling that, I think. And this is making us... Well, a couple hundred at least. So yeah, there you Come go. I mean, you could make some money. I don't know. I'm not going to stress about it too much. Now, uh, which house is this quest? Hello. That is the question. Hello. Um, apparently, this one. Or did I not pick this quest up? There you go. I actually hadn't picked it up, so that was my mistake. Um, I, I guess I did that completely backwards. Oh well, oh well. You guys will forgive me, right? I knew there was a quest. Okay, so now what? Now what is the question? We have, um, we've managed most of the, uh, well, we've done all the promotion quests for the first tier. We haven't done any of the second tier. Um, I guess we should just start clearing out easy areas. Um, let's see, which one's kind of a little bit lost right now on just where I should go next. Um, we might be able to take out... Hmm. There's a lot of quests to pick from. I'm thinking of going back to Castle Iron Fist and uh, trying the uh, Carla Grand's estate, actually. Because I think there's some good stuff there. Mostly we just need money, whatever we do, so... Um, I could try... You know what I should do? Let's uh, save game. Let's head back to uh, New Sorpagal for a minute and make sure spirit magic. Let's make sure everyone's got those things maxed out. So we can learn that. I can train him on repair here, right? I think that's here. I can never remember where everything is like I want. How are you? Spirit, body. Nice to see you. Mind. Hello. Spirit. Okay. So this yes. will make sure that uh, okay. raise dead and the curse work better. Uh, remove curse. So. That was a good idea, I think. Spent that money. How are you? Uh, I thought... Oh, we might have meditation too. Actually. Pleased to meet you. Yes. There we go. Meditation's really cheap. Wow, I didn't know it was that cheap. What about bodybuilding? Okay. Those ones are only 500 bucks, so they're pretty cheap to get. No problem. Um, what about... Hello. Identification? No, we need uh, repair or something. Hello. I can't remember. Maybe repair was back in Iron Fist. Oh well, that's where we're gonna go next anyway. No worries. Nothing to worry about. Need a ride? Get you up the there horse. we go. Okay. So, um, also, just for interest, How sake, are you? where do we need to go for master? Master archery is in Kriegspear. Of course it is. One of the fun spots. Yeah, we're not going to be able to get that easily. Uh, armor experts, we got all that. Three chain. Yeah, everyone's got the armor expertise. Good. Just trying to double check that kind of stuff, make sure we're not missing anything obvious. I know I've been a little bit short on money lately, so I've been concerned that maybe I didn't have uh, How are you? All the stuff I was supposed to. How are you? Expert disarm. I thought there was repair somewhere around. Closed. Um, I guess we could see if these stores have anything. It's been a while since we've been back here, but I don't know. Finest armor in the land. Hey, now that's one of the cool helmets. Oh yeah, actually, that's a good one. So Dawes, you get yourself a new helmet. Come back. I know you like your cool hat, your cool Robin Hood hat, but this one has more intellect and a whole lot more armor. So there you go. Finest armor. Also, did in you the notice? Land. That from this guy, we're actually not getting full discount for a merchant. This guy's a much better uh, negotiator, I think. 
So probably buying and selling for stuff from here is not as good of a plan. Come back soon. Um, any low-level spells? Magic of life. Yeah, I think I'm gonna save my money for that, unfortunately. Repair, repair, repair. Anywhere repair? Hello. Pen? Bodybuilding we already found. How are you? Master of Spirit. No, all right. Pleased to meet you. All right, let's just get out of here. We're fine. Um, so what I want to do today then for the rest of the episode is we're going to start a new dungeon again. We zipped through that first one no problem. Now we're going to go to Corlegon's estate which is down there. And I remember it being kind of fun from before. It's a bit longer than the other ones and has tons of ghosts and stuff. And, uh, you know. I think we can get lots of rings if we can survive it. Also, I was looking up, uh, um the month for the shrines and stuff. I think what I'll do is once we get to the second year, I'll start trying to hit each shrine in a row. So every month there'll be a, a special pilgrimage we'll try to go on. Um, I figure the first year it's a little bit difficult because we're just not powerful enough, but the second year maybe we'll be okay. And uh, permanent stat boost, so there's a good reason for it. Alright, so we do have a quest to go here. I can't remember exactly which one. <laughs> Someone said Corlegon's estate, and I think it might have been Albert Newton, either for um, the promotion or for the council quest. I can't remember which. So either way, let's get started. Once the residence of Archmage Terex, it's probably the council quest, Corlegon received the estate from Archibald for his service during the succession wars. There you go. Oh yeah, this place is familiar. I remember having fun in this dungeon before. I'm very glad that we have uh, uh, Fireball. Alright. Let us begin. <laughs> now, it's not all ghosts, don't worry. There's also... well... We start off with a lot of ghosts. So we're going to use a lot of magic here, and I'm going to have to do a lot of resting and healing in between, because we're going to run out of SP. There's just nothing else to be done, really. Too many ghosts. And they have some nasty effects. Not that we've not that we've seen too many of the bad effects, but uh, There we go, rings. We are gonna get so many rings in here, you don't even know what we're gonna do with them all. Well, so far, nothing terribly exciting, but uh, we're gonna keep our eyes open for good rings. I remember getting some good enchantments. Oh, that was a chest. I thought it was just a table. Just clicking on it like nothing. Mm. Mm, not gonna bring junk. Huh, that's a strange looking chest. Could have exploded because I wasn't uh, I wasn't using the right person to open it. All right. Okay. They might be far enough away, fireball. Well, we hit our own guys, sorry. I thought we had enough room. Uh-oh. So what do you think just happened to Dawsocles, huh? Something bad happened to him. I will show you. He is now magically aged to 24. That's not a big deal, but by the end of this dungeon we could all be very old. <laughs> Alright, let's continue on. So far, most of our damage has been from our self-fireball, thanks to thanks to Dawsocles. <laughs> That's okay, though. I forgive him. It's kind of my fault, anyway. And then we can... Now, after we clear this out, we'll have a nice long hallway to use our archery on. Which is going to be a staple. Because now that you know that they can magically age us, we're not going to want to fight them up close very much. Okay. What's in here? There they come. Try to get some distance on them at the end of this hallway. They're pretty quick though, I mean... Uh... Oops. Oops, oops, oops. Uh, it's hard to get a whole lot of range on them right away. But... One good fireball makes it a lot easier, I think. It just does so much damage. Alright, good. Continue clearing out ghosts. And I believe they give you quite a lot of experience as well, so don't you worry, guys. We're going to get some levels up and stuff. 
Um, this might be a trap, so I'm going to leave that for a little while. Oh boy. Lots of ghosts this time coming for us. Although only one found the doorway. Foolish spirit. Evil spirit. Killed. Alright. We're just going to take our time. Try not to lose too many years to magical aging. And I will use the fireball this time. Just to save some MP. Good job, guys. Good job. I don't know if Spectres always drop a ring, but I know they often do. And then the lower tier guys do fairly regularly. There's a lot of ghosts back there. Okay, let's just fight these guys. The lower tier guys aren't too bad. It's mostly the Spectres, I think, that can do the aging. I'm not sure if the low guys can even do it at all, actually. Alright, so far so good. We're clearing them out. Alright, here's a nice batch of ghosts for us. Dawsicles, you know what to do, right? That's the stuff. Maybe another one with gusto. There you go. Kill them all. Now we'll save a little bit of MP and use some arrows. Should be okay. I don't want to wear out all of his MP right at the beginning. Okay. It appears that ghost wants to run away. Alright, I think this is actually the correct way to go, so I'm going to save that for later. And we're going to go this way first for treasure. Or whatever it is. I can't remember exactly. I think these are all just little rooms with treasure chests in them, actually. So maybe we'll save, just in case. Give it a try. Maybe a ring of fire. Not bad at all. Good. Beautiful. And, as I predicted, a treasure chest room. No traps, uh -huh. by the sounds of it. Ah. Uh. Some kind of lousy rings. Uh. Nothing too exciting, but uh, that's all right. This dungeon isn't really an easy one, so you couldn't do it too much earlier. Okay, that's how you want to play it. We'll fight you. Someone will hit you. Aw, oh, poor Dawes. They're going straight after him again. Well, for now, you just get to feel a little bit older. Being 25 has no uh, negative side effects, so don't worry too much just yet. Turns out evil spirits can aid you as well. It's not just specters. <laughs> so there's that. Got it. And inside this coffin, we find some money. Page from Corligan's diary. Cool. And a boring hammer. Ah, won't worry. So uh, let's just have a quick look at this. Uh, let's keep these things sorted out a little bit. Give these to our identifier. Keep the scrolls in order, maybe. Give these to our brewer. Keep these together. Yeah, just trying to sort the inventory out. So, page from his diary. Oh, he's talking about the Crystal of Terex. Uh, his time is growing short. He was going to be forced to become a lich. He doesn't want to die. Blah, blah, blah. Plot revenge against the Iron Fist for what they've done to Archibald. Alright. Also, we found some random loot on the ground. Woohoo! So we're learning a little bit more backstory. Apparently this, uh, this Corlegon didn't feel very happy about the Iron Fists. We got a skeleton pit here. Not too dangerous. 
I would rather kill a lot of skeletons than a batch of ghosts. So, nothing to worry about here. A little bit of money. One of the main things we're doing here is clearing up an area to rest in after we get into trouble. I wonder if I can fireball these guys. Ah, oh, you hit your own dudes! Oops. oops. Yeah, you would say oops. <laughs> Couldn't even quite angle that fireball in there, could you? <laughs> oh well, I'll forgive him again. <laughs> uh, sometimes it's really difficult to get those uh, just around the corner. They like to uh, clip, sort of. Doorways are tricky things. I thought we could clear it, but... Oh well, I'll just blame it on Dawes and his... Yeah, slightly evil tendencies, let's say. <laughs> oh, ghosts. Alright, we're gonna use some frames here. Yeah, we're gonna pull out the MP. Probably after this battle I'll do a bit of resting. Because, uh... Dawes is running low. One more. Oh, not bad. Not good. That was like a one-shot unconscious sort of spell attack. And another one. Not much you can do about that. No matter what HP you have, they knock you unconscious. Now that was just damage, though. Yeah, so they've got a couple special attacks. They can aid you, and they can uh, basically take all your HP away in one shot. Not very nice, huh? Yeah, kind of junky stuff here. That was lucky, I opened this with the wrong person. <laughs> Still kind of garbage though. Ah. Eh, we'll keep that, maybe enchant it before we sell it. And that will do for this sort of floor area. Yeah, okay. We'll run down to the end here, where I'm pretty sure we'll be able to rest. Not here, we or can't maybe rest not. Here. Not here, we can't Did rest I miss here. an enemy or something? There we go. I just happen to remember this dungeon from a, playing as a kid. I was pretty sure from that end we could rest. And we'll refresh our spells. Maybe I'll show you the beginning of the next floor. And then we can... Uh, well, I'll try to clear this room out if I can. And then I'll wrap this episode up. Here we go! Okay, Dawes, you've got to get a fireball in there this time. There you go. Good job. Much better. That's how we clear out a group. Wow. Much better than last time. I guess we could explore these uh, piles of garbage again. Nothing there. A dagger this time. And nothing in that one. Alright. I'm pretty sure if our perception was high enough, we'd have found something on that little ledge. But uh, so far, our perception just hasn't quite hit the great treasures. Not, not saying there's anything wrong with you, War Raider. <laughs> down, down we go. Yeah. Here's the fun room. One of many. So, um, I think the ghosts will be able to fly up. So if we wait for them, they'll probably just make their way up here eventually. You might be able to, uh, bring a fire some of the guys down low. Uh, but for now, let's just park our butt here start trying to kill these things. Maybe throw some fireballs in there. Alright. Ghosts aren't too bad. Okay, yeah, they're just gonna keep coming. That's fine. Let's put on double speed. We've got a lot of spirits to kill. Firebolts the tougher ones. Next, who's next? Nobody? There's gotta be more, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Just waiting for me to unpause it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there sure is a lot of ghosts out there, huh? Well, I'll try to clear these out, and then uh, we'll end the episode before we go to the next, before we go down there. 
cast, fire ring. This is why we have lots of MP. There you go, nice shot, Commander. Nice shot, War Raider, that was a good one. And Pyro, everybody's helping out. Seems to me we got them in a good spot here. As they make their way through the door, we get enough free hits. Got that one. Nice! I think all that may be left now is uh, perhaps skeletons. Good deal! Oh, I mean, there's a couple ghosts over there. Alright, um... You know, I think if we go down there, we do get a treasure chest or something. But it might be hard to get out of. So maybe we won't go down just yet. Alright, well I'll save this fun, exciting adventure for the next episode. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. And next time, we'll finish off Corleone's estate with uh, a little bit of luck. See you later.